2015, I had just graduated college. I knew that I wanted to do outdoor filmmaking as a career, but I had no idea how to actually make that happen. There was no defined path for doing so, and I was very afraid that I was going to give up on that dream and end up doing some kind of like nine to five desk job where I would just be stuck inside all day and not really like following my passions or anything like that. So I was very much afraid of that kind of lifestyle and I was kind of maybe running away from it or trying to figure out a way to um, turn my passions into a career. So that was like the motivation to do that hike. And um, I kind of figured if I can do this hike and make a documentary about it, then maybe I can at least take myself seriously as an outdoor filmmaker. And maybe this is something that I could pursue as a career. And the funny thing is, I guess once I got out there and once I actually started getting into the hike, it started bringing up all these other kind of personal things I've been dealing with, I guess. Um, when you when you spend that much time alone in the wilderness, you just have a lot of time to think. And I realized that in regular life, you don't you don't have that kind of time and we have all these distractions and stuff like that where we tend to ignore these things and we don't really dig into these kind of um, deeper things that tend to bother us because we can distract ourselves and avoid them. Um, so I kind of got into a lot of that personal stuff on the trail and it was hard and uncomfortable, but after finishing the trail, I realized how like therapeutic that process was and how important that was for me to deal with a lot of that stuff. And, and I'm assuming you're hoping that you want your audience to come on that same journey. By watching yeah. you, it emotionally causes us to think about those things in the time we're watching you go through it, correct? Mm hmm And that was something that I wasn't planning on putting in the movie, or I, I didn't even realize that that was going to happen. It was kind of like an accidental discovery. I think that was the beginning of a path for me. I, I, by doing that trail, that sent me down a path that I'm still on, and I'm, I'll probably be on for a long time. Thank you so much for watching, donating, and following along on our journey. Don't forget to like this video and leave us a comment below. And if you want to see more videos like this, subscribe to our channel today.